Sit down. Uh, make yourself comfortable. Uh, I'm just preparing some stew for lunch. Would you like some? It's homemade. Thank you. I haven't had any lunch yet. Shifty-eyed character, isn't it? Well, he, he doesn't seem very dangerous. Never underestimate the criminal mind, Walter. Beneath that effeminate garb could lie the black heart of a psychotic maniac. Thank you. I guess I'd better answer that. I guess so. Excuse me, sir. I, I was just wondering if we should be eating this. I mean, we are on duty and all. It may appear that I'm just eating stew. In actual fact, I am lulling the suspect into a false sense of security, thereby reducing his defensive reaction and making him more amenable to interrogation. Besides, there's no regulation against eating stew on duty, is there? You know, I saw a film once where the murderer chopped up the body and fed it to the police in a stew. Do you know that is possibly the most moronic statement you have ever made? This is not some stupid cornball film. Walter, sometimes you scare me. So, uh, what can I do for you, officers? You're married, aren't you, Mr. Williams? Uh, yes. Why do you ask? Well, I couldn't help but notice when we came in that the table was set for only one. Where might your wife be, Mr. Wiggins? Oh, uh, she, she's out shopping. And when might she be back, Mr. Wiggins? When, when she's finished shopping? So you don't mind if we wait for her till she returns? Well, well uh, she might not come back today. It's a lot of shopping, Mr. Wiggins. Uh, sometimes she visits her mother, too. Then we'll call her mother. We need to talk to your wife, Mr. Wiggins. Look, I, I don't know if she'll be there or, or not. I mean, she might still be shopping. Well, then, you don't mind if we take a look around while we're waiting, Mr. Wiggins? Uh, uh, no, no problem. Go right ahead. Take note of this, Walter. The carpet has been thrown slightly askew. I saw a film once where this guy buried his wife under the floor, and the rug was off. Sorry. Damn spot here. Write that down, Walt. Exhibit number one, Walter. A tea bag. A Nestle tea bag. That's amazing. How did you know it was a Nestle tea bag? It says so right here. table has a dent in it. Better make note of that, Walter. Walter? Walter, what do you think you're doing? Checking through the ashes? Why? 
I, I saw a movie once where this guy burned his wife in the fireplace, but teeth don't burn. So I was just checking it. Maybe. Hmm, very interesting. Exhibit number two, Walter. all the pieces have come together very nicely. Well, Mr. Wiggins, I'm afraid your game is up. You are under arrest for the brutal murder of your wife. 